Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I understand we are going to start straight away into the next uh, session. We are running a little bit late. This is, um, of course, action track number three on teachers, teaching and the teaching profession. I um, am really, really honored to be your moderator today. My name is Alette van Leur. I'm the director of sectoral policies in the International Labour Organization. And for some of you who are not quite familiar with the International Labour Organization, the ILO, let me just in two sentences explain that we are the very oldest UN agency with over 100 years of existence. Our mandate is nothing short and nothing less than promoting social justice and decent work. And what we do is we are the only UN agency that is not uh, comprised of member states only, but also of workers and employers organization. That's called tripartism. And also what we do is we are setting international labor standards that govern the world of work. And why are we so interested in education? Well, first of all, because teachers, and this session is about teacher, teachers, teachers are workers, and teachers are owed decent work. The governments around here, also in this room, they should know that they actually have the obligation to ensure that fundamental principles and rights at work and ratified international labor standards protect and are applicable to all teachers and teaching personnel in the entire world, so that you know what your obligation in fact is. We are also, of course, interested in education because education is the foundation for a future healthy, productive workforce. And that means growth and development. So I hope I've now explained why the ILO is very proud to be the UN anchor for action track number three on teachers teaching and the teaching profession together with our colleagues who we have worked very closely with um, in UNESCO, of course. But actually, this action track has been from the outset being guided and being led by our fantastic co-leads. And also, let me now quickly introduce the first co-lead from, um, from Nigeria. There are two co-leads uh, in this um, this particular action track, one is Nigeria and one is Romania. Unfortunately, the delegate from Romania could not be here in person. We wish her all the best with her ankle. We, you will see her shortly online. She has broken her ankle and could not, therefore, not be with us today. But first, let me give the floor to Professor Abu Bakr Adama Rashid, who is the Executive Secretary, National Universities Commission of Nigeria. And he is, as I mentioned, the 83 member state co-lead who will now give it's, um, we were going to go into a panel now. And while I just summarize, may I ask the panelists that are lined up for the panel, please to come forward and to take your place at the podium. We will soon start the panel. Let me just also add that um, it actually, we have heard that throughout this conference and uh, the pre-summit that teachers are central to education. And of course, we have just heard we need social dialogue, freedom of association, collective bargaining. We need targeted, adequate, dedicated teacher policies, and we need investments. But of course, what does that all mean? We in ILO and in UNESCO, we very, very, uh, we attach very great importance towards this social dialogue process, and we will soon hear more on the panel about that. But also it comes down to decent work. We have heard that teachers around the world are undervalued. Let's talk about the status of pe uh, teachers in society. They are underpaid, overworked, overburdened, and perhaps as a result, not always motivated. There are ways to address that. We already heard the words political will and trust and particularly also investment. And I think it's very, very important that we now really, uh, we are of course happy that we are discussing that there is a dedicated action track to teachers and the teaching profession. 
This is more than what we had some decades ago, so we are very happy with that. But we really need, need to take it now to the next level. And it's, um, it's uh, therefore now, I hope that a panel now will analyze the elements that we have discussed just now a bit further. And I'm now very pleased to introduce the moderator of the panel. This is Mr. Carlos Vargas Tamis, Chief of UNESCO, Section for Teacher Development and Head of the International Teacher Task Force Secretariat. And we hope to have an engaged discussion with the panel members, but also with yourselves on how to get through this vicious circle of, yes, teachers are important, teachers are central to transforming education, but really the how question. And again, thank you so much, Lija, and also Dr. Rashid for your excellent uh, work as co-leads. Um, and that's, um, that's really very much appreciated. It was always intended that this was a process led by member states. And uh, I believe that for action track, track number three, we can safely say that this has been the case. So thank you so much.